everyone and welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel if you've been a subscriber for a while and if you're new here definitely subscribe down below I'd love for you to come hang out with us so for today's video I decided to switch things up from just a typical vlog which is what I've been doing the most here on my channel and I decided to do a little what I eat in a day video so today I woke up and worked out every single morning. I like do a little at home workout and then I sometimes will eat an egg or like a little omelet or something if I'm feeling it. But most of the time I am going for smoothies. So I sometimes will just have a regular smoothie, but more often than not, I have a smoothie bowl. So typically I will take any kind of frozen fruit that I have lately I've been having a strawberry mango and pineapple mixture so I've been using that and some frozen bananas today I didn't have a frozen banana so I just used a regular banana which is totally fine too um, and I also like to throw some spinach in there because I like to get in my greens and then I will go um, over to the fridge after I filled all that up in the blender bottle and uh, put a little bit of water just to obviously make it a smoother consistency and then I will take it back over and blend it all up and pour it into a bowl and then once I've poured it into the bowl I will grab some granola and I typically use ancient grains this time I used the nature's valley granola it's all that we had in the pantry at the time so that's what I used and then I sliced up a little bit of banana and put that on top and drizzled some local honey on top of that. I think honey just makes the smoothie bowl so much sweeter and I don't know, it just definitely makes it. It's like the perfect topping. So that's like basically what I do every morning for a smoothie bowl and sometimes I'll switch it up and do like strawberries and blueberries or whatever but lately I've been into kind of the tropical vibe smoothies so yeah, that's what I've been doing. And then later on, I decided to go ahead and make my lunch. So I did have some leftovers. My mom had made a roast a day or two ago. So the great thing about quarantine is that you can have leftovers like all the time. So I had that as kind of my protein, but then I made a salad to go along with it. So lately I have been loving making salads. I love salads in general, but I've never really just like made salads at home. I always buy salads like when I go to restaurants and stuff, but yeah, I started making this one at home and I love it. It is just obviously lettuce, olive oil, Italian seasoning. You can use Greek seasoning if you have that. Feta cheese, which feta cheese is so good, but um, yeah, so I basically just take this little container that my mom has. She has like little plastic containers um, and I find that they are great for like portion control so you're not getting like too much oil. It's just like makes the perfect amount for your salad. And I will dump some Italian seasoning into the bottom of that and then pour some olive oil on top of it. And then I will take a fork and kind of whisk that all together so it kind of blends and makes a nice little dressing to put on top of my salad. And then after that, I will put some feta cheese on there. Sometimes I will put like tomatoes on it if we have cherry tomatoes on hand this day we didn't. But yeah, I make it really, really simple and it's so good. Very limited ingredients, um, but very clean and it's so yummy. So that's what I've been doing a lot for lunch lately. If I'm not having leftovers though, I will sometimes have avocado toast, which my avocado toast, I literally just toast the bread. I typically use sourdough bread. And then I take my avocados, mash them up and spread them onto the toast. And then I will take a little bit of olive oil drizzle on top and then take some different spices and things, salt and pepper and put it on top. So simple, but so good. After lunch, I needed to go out and run some errands. So I decided I was gonna go buy Starbucks, which normally I don't do. If I'm gonna be making coffee at home, I'll insert a little clip um, of the coffee I've been loving lately, the coffee combo that I've been loving. You can get these products, I'm pretty sure, at like every grocery store ever. They're super good, but I did kind of splurge and treat myself and go to Starbucks because I was running errands, so why not? But I just got a grande sweet cream cold brew. That's like my go-to anymore. Yeah, that's all I've had so far today. It is close to four o'clock. So we will be 
eating dinner at some point tonight. Typically I let my mom kind of dictate dinner. So we'll see what we have um, and whatever it ends up being, I'll obviously share it with you guys. Okay guys, so it's a little later in the day. It is almost 6.30 now, so we are about to have dinner and we're actually having this ravioli dish from Costco. So I don't know if any of you guys shop at Costco. I love Costco and they have the best little like pre-made trays that you just stick in your oven. So tonight we had the ravioli one with some salad. Again, you guys know I'm obsessed with salad, Bentley, stop. Um, but yeah, you guys know I've been obsessed with salad, so had that again. I try to limit my carb intake um, just because like my body personally holds on to carbs like crazy. These are pretty much the only carbs other than the coffee that had some carbs in it that I had today um, and the fruit obviously, but the dinner is super easy. So these are nice to have on hand actually while we're all in quarantine and we just need to quickly like make something and it feeds my entire family. There's five of us here because Zach's with us right now, but probably afterwards I will eat a little strawberry dessert because um, I went by our local strawberry stand and got some strawberries today. They are like in full bloom right now. Like they are the best uh, pick of the crop. So I'm loving getting fresh local strawberries and supporting local businesses right now with everything going on. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna have probably strawberry, like a little strawberry dessert um, tonight. Obviously guys, you can tell I'm obsessed with fruit, but yeah, fruit's like my favorite. So anyway, yeah, I know this video was super quick and whatnot, but I just wanted to give you guys a little inspiration and some ideas of what to eat during this time because I know it's like hard to think of different things to eat and switch things up every day. So hopefully this inspired you a little bit and if you enjoyed this video definitely give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below. I'd love to have you here on the channel. So I guess that's it for now and I'll see you guys in the next one.